Alright, here we go with another video tutorial for the Droid Max. Okay, in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to set an alarm using the Droid Command Center. The Droid Command Center is the widget that you see here. It has three circles. The first one is for time, the second one is for the weather, and the third one is used for settings. Now we're going to set a new alarm using this Droid Command Center. The first thing you're going to do is press the circle with the time located in it, and that brings you directly to the alarms screen. To create a new alarm, press the plus sign at the top right of the window. Now enter in the time that you want the alarm to go off. I'm going to type in 1058 and don't forget to press AM or PM and then press OK at the bottom right. Now when you create a new alarm it's going to be automatically turned on. If you want to turn it off slide the blue button to the off position but for now I'm going to leave it on. If you want to create a name for the alarm press label and then type in a name for the alarm. After you have typed in your name click OK. Now here's the important part. How often do you want this alarm to repeat or do you want it to repeat at all? If you want it to repeat place a check mark in the box next to repeat and select the days that you want it to repeat. If you do not want the alarm to sound on various days deselect that day by pressing it and make sure that there's no blue line underneath the day that you don't want the alarm to sound. If there is a blue line located under a day of the week then the alarm will sound on that particular day. The next thing we're going to do is select the type of ringtone that you want to hear when the alarm goes off. So press the musical note icon and that's going to bring up the options for the ringtones. You can go through the options and select the one that you like the most. After you have made your choice press OK at the bottom right. Now do you want the phone to vibrate when the alarm goes off? If you do place a check mark next to vibrate. Now let's take a look at a few more options for the alarm. Press the menu button at the top right and then press settings. Now let's take a look in the alarms section. The first option that we're going to adjust is silence after. So press that and here are your choices. So what you're choosing right now is how soon after the alarm goes off do you want it to be silent? And the options are in five minute increments. I'm going to press cancel and move on to the next option which is snooze length. Press that. Now what that means is when the alarm goes off you're going to have a certain amount of time before the alarm automatically comes back on. This is your snooze time and you can adjust that to your liking. So make the adjustment and then press OK. The next option is the alarm volume. How loud do you want the alarm to be when it goes off? And you can adjust it by simply moving the slider to the left or right depending upon how loud you want the volume to be. When you're done press OK. And the last option we're going to look at is the volume button. Do you want the volume buttons to snooze the alarm or completely dismiss the alarm or do absolutely nothing to the alarm? Those are your options for that. I'm going to press cancel to go back to the settings screen. Now let's go back to the alarm itself by pressing the back button on the phone. And the last thing I want to show you is how to delete the alarm. If you want to delete the alarm, simply swipe it to the right. And as you can see at the bottom, the alarm has been deleted. If you have any questions, please visit the website droidmaxhelp.com and post a comment. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next tutorial.